Hello everybody and welcome back once again to Grim Grim Fandango here on Video Game So. Hades Manticore as always. Whee! Oh, this is new. This is new. <laughs> nah, if I let that waiter out now, he'd have me eight balled from the club. I don't want you to let him out on top of it. There's no opening up here. Well, maybe maybe that freaking can opener will finally come with some use then. Wow, you just let it go. Just set it and forget it. Get in maybe? I don't know. This is how we're getting into the basement, I guess. Well, somebody's sleeping on the job. Yeah, it's sleeping on the job. He's just fucking locked in a freezer that no one seems to be noticing. Ah, it's empty. <clears throat> Ruben! Where are you? Taking a little nap, a vous, eh? Well, le keg is le empty, so tout sweet, Buster. Yes, monsieur. Merci anything you say. Eight oh, more wine. Oh, I'm going to fire him for ignoring my pleas. <laughs> and then I believe I shall quit. Oh, I can never look at that pantry again. No man should ever be locked up in such a small, dark place. Not even the man in the iron mask. Hope no one notices the gaping hole I cut for myself. That would just be unfortunate. Alright, we're in. We in. Is there anything down here? So there's a forklift, I suppose. I'm supposed to do the forklift. Seriously, what am I? Oh, oh, what am I supposed to do with the forklift? Just drive it out. We later, nerds. Let me leave. Huh. Well. There's only one thing you do in a time like this. Donuts. Very slow donuts. Just kidding, I'm not gonna do that shit. What am I supposed to do with this forklift? We're gonna crash. Good old standing forklift. Not really sure what I'm supposed to do with it, though. Can I, like, raise it up, or...? Wait a minute. There's a button on the wall over here. Let's ram into it! Very slow spin. Oh, wait a minute. Wait. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Oh, wait. I think I... Wait. This will just lead me to the top floor. Which I obviously can't go out, because that dude's out there and he'll beat me up. Or eat me or something. I think what I'm supposed to do... Is jam the forks here. Into the wall as the elevator's going, so it catches me on one of the floors I can't access normally, I think. Like that one right there, for instance. I can't get through this door. Sure you can. If you believe in yourself, you can. Okay. Hit it. And then run. Get in. Punch it!
don't understand. I think that's what I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what I'm supposed to do. Just like, I'm not doing it right, maybe? I don't know. I think if I just keep slamming it in, eventually it'll work. Just like sex. Get in the lift, Manny. Please, quick! Into the forklift! Fuck! Ram. 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 Uh, senpai. I can't get through this door. I can't get through this door. Why don't you just use any sense of logic, Manny? I mean... Maybe it's the other hole I've gotta do. I don't know. Punch it. Forward. Go! Oh god, I did it. See, I knew that was the right thing to do. I just had to try it 800 times. And pull this lever, maybe. Strong. Strong ass fucking <laughs> forklift we got here. Cool. Dios mío, it's full of double end tickets. This could get a hundred souls on the number nine train. Something's not right about this. I get the feeling this suitcase belongs to someone more important than Chow Chilla Charlie. You just walk out the front door, you know? That'd be a good idea. Oh right, shit. Manny. Give me the case. Charles, I thought we had a bargain. No, we do. But I thought I'd bring some muscle along just in case. What's the matter, Chuck? Can't afford to hire goons to do this sort of work for you? Daisy doesn't just make BB I mean. guns anymore. Now drop it. You said it, boss. Got a card for me? Here. Welcome to the union, Manny. Meetings first Tuesday of every month, and uh, don't forget to pay your dues. I need to pull a gun on me, Chachia. Jeez. Don't forget to pay my dues. <laughs> Jeez. What a clown. Okay. So that's the union card. Right. It's one thing down, of course. Damn it. Ugh. Hold on. Actually, wait, isn't this where the thing is? No, nope, that's upstairs. Upstairs! Here's something. Metal detector. I think I figured it out. Hold on. Gold's a metal, isn't it? Pound it. Well, Pound just a sip. Pound it, Manny. Yes! <sighs> Maybe just a sip. I really got a two for drinking that. Up. Oh. We've been caught, man. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. I hope that works at least. It makes sense, kind of, doesn't it? Yes, it worked. Are you sure you're not packing anything else? Nothing well, that would set off that thing. Then, sir, I'm <laughs> afraid you'll have to step into the back with me. Ooh. Rules are rules. And of course, with my dad being in the military, we moved around a lot. Mm hmm I remember this one town we moved to when I was in the first grade. Oh, really? Yeah, the only industry in the area was figs. Acres and acres of fig trees everywhere you looked. I myself never really cared for figs. I always liked dates more. Or prunes. Don't you just love prunes? Mmm, dates. They have such a great texture. They're all wrinkled up like my grandma Hedwig's face. Oh, <laughs> 
poor Grandma Hedwig. Never a big fan of prunes. She was always forgetting things. I remember one time back when I was six. Or yeah, maybe Edward, I was that's seven. That's an interesting name. No, 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 no. I had to be six because Mr. Rufus was still alive. Now Funny, there was the a good dog, book. Mr. Rufus. He was such a sweet little puppy. We didn't care that he was deaf. He was as deaf as they come, but he'd still try to bark. Huh? What's that? <laughs> and it would come out sounding like a cat coughing up a hairball, which our cat often did. He what had the such fuck's happening? Hair. I remember I had a hairball once. I don't really like long-haired cats, do you, Manny? They're just no, so... No, because the taxidermist charges extra for them. I like short-haired cats. They seem less stuck up. People think I'm stuck up sometimes, believe it or not. No, 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 they really do. I don't know why. I no, guess it's I because I'm so shy. That. I was shy all the way through high school. I never went to a single dance. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> no. Don't get me wrong, the boys would ask, but I just run away. Yes, you seem shy. My mom said I could have been homecoming queen if I'd just smile once in a while. <laughs> she always said a smile is the most important part of Your any mom outfit. Your must have loved you very much. Well, maybe I would have smiled more, Mom, if you hadn't drank so much. Was I supposed to smile when the cops called us in the middle of the night to tell us to come uh. get you out of the drunk tank? <laughs> maybe if I had smiled more, Daddy wouldn't have left us. I really have to go. We'd be together right now. You, me, Daddy. Yikes. And Grandma Hedwig. And Mr. Rufus. And I'd be wearing my homecoming queen crown. That reminds me. I need to call my bookie. figs and... And... And I'd... go, oh, mother! Yes. <laughs> Let it out. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> now, now. Don't cry. Let me hold that metal detector. <laughs> I thought I would just be getting naked in here. I wasn't ready for this shit. Don't cry. Here, let me hold that metal detector for you while you cry. Did you just come back here to ask to borrow my metal detector? No way. No way. Oh, okay. Now where was I? Oh yeah. So the only industry in town was Fuck. figs. Acres and acres of fig trees everywhere you looked. I myself never really cared for figs. Actually, you were farther than that in your story. I always liked dates more. Or prunes. Don't oh you just no. Love prunes? Mm, dates. They have such a great texture. They're all wrinkled up like my grandma Hedwig's face. Oh. <laughs> Poor Never Grandma Hedwig. She was always oh, forgetting things. I remember one time back Edwin, when I was that's six. that's an interesting name. Or maybe I was. I might seven. be in for the long no, 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 haul no. here. I had to. Well, maybe I would have. Oh no! Mom She's going through the same thing again. So much. Very much. Was I supposed to smile when the cops called us in the middle of the night to tell us to oh, come wow. get you out of the drunk tank? Maybe if I had smiled more, Daddy wouldn't have left us. <laughs> I would smile more. We'd be right together now. right now. You. Me, Daddy, and Grandma Hedwig. I really have to go. And Mr. Rufus. <laughs> you can make this one look very mentally unstable if you just keep repeating this conversation and again and again. And I... Yeah, I gotta piss her off. I don't know. Don't cry. Cause I think I just gotta say, hey, let me hold that metal detector while you cry. Here, let me hold that metal detector for you while you cry. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't just come back here for this metal detector? Actually, I just come back here. Actually, I did come back here just for your metal detector. <laughs> Manny, you're a dick. What is it with you in this thing? I'm sick of it, Manny. If this is all you want, you can fight the cats for it. Why is it all men are after the same thing? Except you. The only woman you care about is that Colomar dame, and she split on you. I don't know what she did to you, but you know what? I'm done trying to figure it out, pal. Carla. Carla actually sounds pretty, pretty familiar. Well, later. Nice talking to you. Bye, Carla. Drop dead. I just wanted your metal detector. Let me go fetch it from the shit box. Well, that's the hole I saw Carla's metal detector fall through. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm. I'm not going in there. 
Do you need it? Your metal detector's I'm not in there. Going in there. What about my scythe? That's good, right? I can just scythe my way through this. Through this life. What the hell was that? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Aha! Oh, he was metal detecting, I guess. Oh no, he was setting it off with his metal detect with setting the metal detector off of the scythe. Brain no work, no good. Got it. A little stinky, but it could be worse. Yeah, could be covered in cat shit. Oh wait. Can't get any better than that. Fuck. Okay, I got the metal detector. I've got the baster. I can get that. Wait. This is... I do not remember where that other guy was. He's like the end of some crazy dock. He's not beneath the zeppelin, that's for sure. Do you remember where that one sailor dude is? I guess that's Naranga. But I certainly don't have a fucking clue. Oh wait, no, he was down by the railroad tracks. What am I talking about? What am I thinking about? Womp womp. But before that, I'm gonna guess that uh, I need to get... I'm gonna guess I can use the turkey baster on the fucking hookah water that knocked people out. Don't walk into the elevator, Manny. I will kill you. I'm not joking. I will kill you twice. I'm like a Yakuza, I'll kill you five times before you hit the ground. Hey Olivia, bye Olivia. Metal detector. Give me a card. I wouldn't put that back in my lapel. Uh, he put it back in his lapel. Oh, that's gross. Get my way. Yep. Well, catch you later, hip chick. Keep practicing that lingo, man. You'll get it. I just wanted to stare at you for a minute and say goodbye. Dude's got his own little establishment in here. Looks like it hurts. It's empty. Yeah, I got to remember to get more liquid nitrogen from more Liquid nitrogen? Freeze the bones, less painful that way. Hey, that sounds good. I could go for that. You've got plenty of painkiller in that bottle of yours, so shut up and hold still. Hopefully he won't notice me base this water in. I don't really want to do that. Hey, you do. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Okay, I obviously can't just do it straight up. I gotta, like, go into this fridge. It's empty. It's empty? Ah! Wait, he's distracted. Who is over there? When I am done with Naranja here, I am going to tattoo big floppy ears on the side of your head so people will know what a jackass you are. I don't really want to do that. Okay, I think I could do it while they're staring at the fridge. But I gotta act quickly. I don't really want to do, do it. There we go. Poke Olba. Look, you broke it. Now it won't shut. That's unfortunate. I like how he's just kind of like staring at the ground now. Nemozogia, hold still. What are you? Dead. 
Ah, Kaifa, wake up. I don't work on drunks. Resek Chavargo. What kind of sailor are you? <clears throat> Can't handle booze, huh? What you tell us gonna know what anger at the name folks give his at me. The deliation bolond watch. Well, let's go. Toto, I got your boy Naranya here. MIA he is. Well, he's sobered up. I send him to limbo. Yeah, yeah. He'll make it there by morning. Promise. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That Let's is what, see what I told you. what you got him. on you, huh, sailor? Are you kidding me? and Selmo Naranja Ensign third class. Doesn't look like you'll be showing up to I work in the morning. I gave him the idea in first place. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. All right, let's get ah, out of here, then. Tiger can't change his stripes. Later. I don't think I need anything else from there, at least. What am I supposed to do with dog tags? think of is probably getting my key back from that guy. So I gotta head for the high roller lounge again. I mean, I just threatened to beat him up. Manny could take him. He's a strong skeleton. You don't need no man. Yeah! Is he still over here? I threatened to beat him up. Damn it. There! Okay. He's over there looking at some yeah, fucking hentai or something. Hey, asshole. Almost Let's fight. Those tricks, Nick. Yeah. I have to tell this to someone. I hate cats. Me too. But they keep the lights on around here. True. Virago, I really need a lawyer. What is it this time, Calavera? What's that? Someone's claiming my roulette tables are fixed. Starting a class action suit, lots of money involved. Someone's claiming my roulette tables are fixed. But your roulette tables are fixed. Exactly. That's why I need a lawyer. So will you be needing a regular lawyer? Are an excellent lawyer. An excellent, an excellent lawyer. lawyer. Any excellent lawyer are the best excellent lawyer. I gotta stroke this guy's ego for him, I guess. The very best is good enough for me. And who would you say that would be, Calavera? Who would you say is the best lawyer you know? In Johnny all Cochran. The land of the dead. You are, Nick. You are, Nick. That's right. And that's why Maximino retains me on an exclusive basis. So, sorry, but I don't do odd jobs. Yeah, you do. Sorry, I don't do odd jobs. How's tricks, Nick? Yeah. Virago, I really need a lawyer. Well, my dance card is full. So what are you gonna do? I'll ask Max, I can borrow you. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. That sort of claim could send a man like Max into quite a rage, especially if the messenger had no proof. Max and I are friends. He'll believe me. People believe what they want to believe, Calavera. And I want to believe you're a smart man who doesn't go around spreading dangerous rumors. I've got to talk to Max for a moment. When I get back, I hope you're gone, because I'm sick of looking at you. I guess I cheesed him off enough to fucking leave. Hey, I'm gonna steal your cigarette case. Man, this is gonna get me in trouble. There's something rattling inside. Must be in a hidden compartment somewhere, but I don't see a latch or anything. Oh. Put away the metal detector, Manny. That's just absurd. Alright, let's get out of here. That one chick took a picture, didn't she? That's my proof, buddy. Oh, God, help the beast in me. Oh, he's the elevator right here. Alright. Making progress. Hmm. 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 Wait, damn it. Maybe this chick will help me after I blatantly blew her off. Forgiving me yet? Still in the anger phase. 
Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. And then jump out the damn window. Oh, Carla. How do I get this key out then? It's Virago's cigarette case. It's Virago's cigarette case. It's Virago's cigarette case. What's that? Cigarettes, does it look like? It's a new compact for your makeup. It's a little something special I bought for you. I don't know, I found it on your desk. Cigarettes? What does it look like? Don't try to make nice, Manny. It's too late. What? It's a little something special I bought for you. Don't try to make nice, Manny. It's too late. What? It's a new compact for your makeup. Manny, I don't wear makeup. You know that. And True. I'm not saying you need to. Good. You're a natural what? beauty. I don't know. I found it under your desk. Unattended? No, there's a guy with shifty looking crazy guys. Yes. yes. Oh my god. Give me that! It's a bomb! Little... Little bit of a stark overreaction here. Jesus. Ha ha! Another senseless act of terrorism nipped in the bud by security officer Carla. Wow. It was completely destroyed by our own detonator, so I can't tell what kind of bomb it was. But here's something. A key? I better bring that to Chief Bogan. Yeah, you can analyze it with your metal detector. Yep. Gonna guess that key unlocks the lighthouse? Which is this way. Damn it. Lighthouse is this way, right? On the card? Let me see it. Oh, 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 one of Charlie's rush jobs. Good thing your new captain's far-sighted. Uh, still no room for you on board. Naran's just sleeping off a bad one, but he'll be here. But I'm first on the waiting list. As it were, yeah. And don't forget that Glottis has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good. Because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. Okay, tools. Naranga. Gotcha. Kill Naranga. It's locked. It's locked. Scythe. Key. Open. Let's go in here and see what's in there. Lola? Careful, Manny. You may not want to see me like this. Lola! Did Nick do this to you? Yeah. He wanted that picture real bad. Oh, God. He's never gonna find it, that thing. I'll get him, Lola. I'll show Max the picture for you and fix Nick for good. Just tell me where you hid it. Oh, Manny, it's all my fault. Always falling for the wrong guys. You know, I even had a thing for you once. But you were so hung up on that Meche woman, I, I figured I didn't have a chance. Lola, where's the picture? Tell me, Manny, when I've had a chance? Never mind. You just want Olivia for me. Tell her to improve her taste in men, or she'll end up just like me. Tell her to get a nice guy, Manny. Like you. Lola! Oh, God. Lola! She got sprouted. What was that? You didn't deserve this. Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22, lengua. Hey, what? Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it. And it says number 22, lengua. Lengua number 22. Hey, you guys know what lengua 22 means? What the hell's lengua mean? Wait a minute. Wait. I know how to... I think I know how to fucking... Get rid of Naranga. I think it's pretty easy, actually. Mm. 
Are you sure you're looking hard enough? Look, Manuel, these old eyes are tired. I'm doing the best I can, but the average retirement age beachcomber has more sophisticated equipment than I've got here. Well, why well, I've got something that could help. A Langua number 22 card. God, my lapel is so full of I don't of really want to do that. Hey, you do. I don't really want to do that. Would a metal detector help the cause? Hey, just like downtown. Where all the lights are bright. You never know what this will turn up. An engraved ring, a belt buckle with somebody's name on it. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the... Oh. He just had his dick out. Huh. We did it. Yoranga's dead now. <laughs> what? Velasco, it looks like I've got one of your boys down here in the morgue. A sailor by the name of... Naranja. What? How? Sprouted? But... Ah, oh, this town's going to hell. Sailor can't even take a two-day shore leave without watching his back. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down in the morning. Except you'll be gone by then. <sighs> All day long, Manny. I sort through pure sadness. I find evidence. And I piece together stories, but none of my stories end well. They all end here, and the moral of every story is the same. We may have years, we may have hours, but sooner or later, we push up flowers. It's a pretty good poem. Better than the one that, that beatnik chick does. Anyway, I'm going to call this part here. I think I made a lot of really good progress. And I hope I can get to, you know, year three soon. I think there's four years overall. That's what the achievements show, at least. Anyway, I'm, as always, you know who I am. Hades Manticore, Had Video Games Ho. Thank you so much for watching. If you are, like, subscribe if you're enjoying. See you on the next part. Goodbye.